Hey folks and welcome to Car Stars' 10 cool facts about Duke's 57 Chevy, aka Project X, in the 1980 movie The Hollywood Nights. Fact number one. The highly customized 1957 Chevy 210 used in the movie actually wasn't a car built for the film at all, but a borrowed ongoing project car for the popular hot rodding magazine nicknamed Project X. As per George Elliott, who ran the magazine group at the time, the car was purchased for $700 in 1965. The idea behind Project X was the car would be an ever evolving product and technical testing car for the magazine to try out new popular hot riding parts for the readers of the magazine. Readers were also encouraged to mail in their own ideas of parts and customizations to try out on the car as well. Fact number two. The car started out bone stock and in quite worn out neglected condition with over 70,000 miles on the odometer. It had a beat 283 V8 with a three on the tree manual speed transmission. The engine was rebuilt and bored out to a 292 and built back up with budget aftermarket parts that average hot riders could afford. This was the very beginnings of the famed Project X57 Chevy and the theme of sourcing popular budget aftermarket parts and testing them for their readers continued on for decades to come. Fact number three. At the time of its featuring in the film, the car was running a 671 blown 283 small block with a 4 speed manual transmission, dishing out just enough power to lift the front wheels at the track at least. However, truth be told, they did have to add quite a bit of weight to the trunk to get that wheel stand shot for the magazine though. Fact number 4. After filming concluded, Project X was left mostly unchanged for a few years as it leveraged its star power touring numerous shows and advertising events across the country. It also spent a fair amount of time broken down in the shop and ignored since it was mostly just an occasionally exploited company owned promotional tool at that point. Fact number 5. One notable installation to Project X came in the early 2000s when GM released their new 502 Ramjet fuel injector performance big block crate engine which GM's performance division installed in Project X to showcase it. They also gave Project X a partial restoration at this point and of course repainted her yet again in the signature Corvette bright yellow paint to pretty it up for shows. Fact number six. Project X's next big engine featuring swap came in 2007 when GM released the very special 40th anniversary limited edition all aluminum 427 ZL1 big block crate engine and installed it into Project X. However, this time, the car received a very extensive inside and out overhaul by famed automotive designer David Ross, modernizing the overall look of the car, giving it a more pro-touring aesthetic. Fact number seven. And probably the most controversial Project X overhaul came in 2021 when GM decided to modernize the car yet again by this time converting it to a fully electric powered vehicle using their new E-Crate GM EV powertrain. Yes, there have been many complaints by longtime Project X patrons on this particular conversion choice for sure. However, we must take a step back and remember that the whole purpose of Project X and why it was even acquired in the first place was for it to be a constantly evolving project demonstrating present day automotive performance trends throughout the ages. So it is in fact still doing exactly that. Fact number eight, during its use in the film, Tony Danza actually blew engines twice in the car due to over revving from improper shifting as he was inexperienced at driving stick. You can actually see one such occurrence within the movie in this scene when the burst of white smoke rolls over the top of the car when racing the Cobra. Fact number nine. Project X was actually stolen and stripped of most of its parts at one point in time in the late 1960s. George Elliott found the car up on blocks under a freeway overpass not far from his home. With most of its more valuable parts stolen off of it, he had his team recover the car shortly after. Fact number 10. Project X still exists today and is still in a constant cycle of change, which is really the only thing consistent about Project X really. Speaking of which, Project X has recently been swapped from EV back to a gasoline powered big block in celebration of Hot Rod's 75th anniversary. And not just any big block either, but the biggest GM big block yet, the mighty 1004 horsepower ZZ632. This engine is so huge that they even had to modify the firewall this time to make it fit. We can only imagine what the future may bring for Project X. Who knows, maybe it's next big conversion 20 years from now could be some kind of flying car for all we know. Well, there you have it folks. Thanks for watching and make sure to hit that subscribe button if you like what you saw here. You guys are all great. See you next time.